This is the last video in the chapter of perimeter and area where we'll be discussing about the units used in area and their conversions. As you are aware that the unit what we use for the area is, is square followed by the unit, square unit. So that is square centimeter, square meter and so on and so forth. Now how they are converted with respect to different units. Let's say that I have a 1 centimeter or let me just take it this way. Consider this square box which is roughly of the dimension 1 centimeter by 1 centimeter. Now how many small squares in it I can fit of the dimension 1 millimeter? Now, as you can say that in this one centimeter, I can have small dimensions of 10 such millimeter. The same is the case of this. In this one centimeter, I can divide into 10 different millimeter. Let me just expand this view. Consider this in an expanded view that okay this is not the actual dimension I have just zoomed out this square if you see that I have just zoomed out this square consider it as a straight line and then I am just talking about dividing this into 10 different parts. The same way I am trying to divide this into 10 different parts where each part will give me a millimeter. Now if I try to make a square here and so forth and the same thing I try to make a square here And then I start counting that how many such squares of 1 by 1 millimeter I will get in 1 centimeter then it would turn about to be 10 cross 10 that is 100 such millimeters square. So I can safely say that one square centimeter area is equal to 100 square millimeter area. That gives me one centimeter square is 100 millimeter square. So let me just reiterate this. What I have done is I have 1 cm by 1 cm square area. I just zoomed it and I am trying to divide the side, the dimensions into its millimeter. So I would get 10 such millimeters. The same thing with the breadth. I will get the 10 different small small units. I am trying to see how many such millimeter squares are there in this centimeter which turn out to be 10 cross 10 that is 100 such millimeter squares. So that means the area which is enclosed in 1 square centimeter is equal to the area which would be enclosed by 100 square millimeters. So that gives me the formula that 1 centimeter square is 100 millimeter square. Well it's safe to assume that this would turn out to be as the square of the unit here it is 10 mm so the square of this millimeter square. The same formula I can extend 
it to the meter one square meet one meter square would be equal to hundred square centimeter square that gives me ten thousand centimeter square this is a new unit for you that is known as hectare a hectare or you can say one hectare is a land mainly it's used to define the area of a land the area of a land that is occupied by a side of 100 meter by 100 meter so what is one hectare one hectare is the area of the land which is enclosed by a side of 100 meter length you can say that it's 100 meter 100 square by meter square that is 10,000 meter square so this is a new concept for you that is or the new unit for you that is a hectare one hectare which is generally used to measure the land so that's it for this chapter we have covered the area we have covered the area of polygons the area of the circle some different applications as well as the conversions of the units for area thanks for now